Hey Windows fans, I'm Mark for WindowsCentral.com. You probably use your Xbox One mostly for gaming, but did you know that you can install apps on it as well? Well, here we are on the home screen. If we go all the way to the right by pressing the RB button on your controller, you can select apps over here. And then you can see there are several apps that you can install. You can see apps that are featured right now, what's popular, and the new releases. All right, so if you want to install something, let's go check out what's popular right now. Uh, let's try, oh, let's go install ESPN. All right, so it's going to give a description, some images over here. Let's, let's check that out. All right, and if I like this app, and I want to install it, just click the get it free button over here. And then it's going to ask me for confirmation. And that's basically it. Uh, immediately after the download is done, I can press and hold the Xbox One button on my controller to quickly launch it. All right, so after you go crazy installing several apps, you can access those apps by going to My Games and Apps from the dashboard. And uh, you can go over here where it says Games. Just below that is the, all your apps. If I want quicker access to these applications, um, I can pin it to the home screen. So I'm going to, let's try to pin uh, Skype. So I'm going to press the, the menu button over here. And then I'm going to select Pin to Home. So now Skype is going to show up on my Xbox dashboard. Here it is on the left side. All right, so that's basically how you can install an app on your Xbox One. If you know the name already and you don't want to go through the, the store and the, the list of names, just go over to the search bar over here and type the application you want to install. So for example, I'm going to type in Vine because I heard that app for Xbox One just came out and it's going to list it and then I can install it directly from over here. So it's a lot faster than going through the store. All right, that should be it. If you have any more questions, head over to windowscentral.com for more details. I'm Mark Wim. Thanks for watching.